This stuff financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. Look, I tell every day, the data they release us is false. It meant to give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, by now, everybody knows that Vlad Tenev, the CEO of Robinhood, has sold 50% of his shares in Robinhood. Now, there's a lot of speculation as to why he did that. Um, some people are claiming that the reason that he did it was because Robin Hood is in trouble and Robin Hood is about to crash. I'm going to tell you guys something. This is just my opinion. I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell Robin Hood stock. But there's a distinct possibility that Vlad might know. Not he might know. Of course he knows. He knows things that we don't know. He sees things that we don't see. And Maybe these new transparency rules when it comes to short selling is making all these bad actors pause. He might be thinking that if payment for order flow drops, if these new transparency rules shut down the naked shorting, that they might not to, they might not be able to be as profitable. And that the stock price is going to crash. And because of that, he's getting out to play. It could be that he just want to make some cash to pay taxes. I mean, <clears throat> there's a whole lot of different reasons why Vlad might be selling 50% of his Robin Hood shares. And I know it, it leads to a lot of speculation. But in my opinion, I believe that. These new transparency rules is putting a lot of pressure on the stock market. A lot of these so-called smart money, they're not smart. The only reason that they can beat us is because the rules are stacked against us. And even, even with the rules stacked against us, when I say stacked against us, I mean stacked against retail investors. Even with the rules stacked against retail investors, they still have to break the law. They have to break the law, break the rules in order to beat us. So are they really smart money? They're not smart money. They're criminal money. Okay? The only if they were so smart, would they have to break the rules to win when the rules are already stacked in their favor? They wouldn't. They wouldn't. So they're not smart money. They're 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 criminal money. But I believe Vlad is selling his stock in Robinhood. Because he feels that the value of Robin Hood is going to drop when these new rules are put in place. And with the possibility of payment for order flow coming off the table, that would greatly reduce Robin Hood revenue. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Why do you think Vlad is sold 50% of his, of his Robin Hood, of his Robin Hood shares? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.